welcome. Well, that, that new show of yours looks hilarious. Uh, yeah, really, really funny. No, it's uh, it's definitely not a funny show. I won't hit you or anything. Thank really? you for having me on the no, show. No, it's always nice to have you on the show. I like what you're doing with the basic black. Oh, well, thank oh, you yeah. so much. Yeah, thank you. it's all working. You're all kind of squeezed into mm, it and everything. I loved your monologue. Can we just talk about Sarah Palin? Because that would be just so much more interesting. Do you want to talk about Sarah Palin? <laughs> well, actually, you know, I've, my, my television has been on all weekend with Sarah Palin and... Gustav. And Gustav. Just yeah, so yeah, much yeah. news in the There was a guy in the Weather Channel. Um, I, I don't know who the guy is, but he wouldn't call it Gustav. He kept calling it Gustav. I oh. watch the Weather Channel. I know it's not affiliated with CBS. <laughs> but you know what? Bleep that. <laughs> they could pixelate that out. Anyway, the... Uh, no, but I watch the Weather Channel because I enjoy weather. Do you enjoy weather? I, I love it. Well, uh, it's not my favorite subject. And traffic interests me more, actually. Yeah. I have it in my car. I have a little traffic button that I can push. Do you have a big swanky car? Because you must have made I a do. bit of money on that Married with Children show. Well, you I know, I, I did, but, I, but it, some of that's gone. But I still have a big swanky divorce? car. <laughs> Was that oh, divorce? Well, yes. You Matt, too, right? Oh, it's expensive. Crap, it is that expensive. Stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's very, very, expensive. very expensive. But, you know, I'm working my way back. Yeah, yeah. Well, you've got the, the new hilarious new comedy <laughs> on there. <laughs> now, tell me the story about this, because it looks very, it's very serious drama. Obviously. Well, it's a it's a family drama right. actually that takes place in the world of an outlaw motorcycle club. So. Oh. We're actually, uh, yeah, see, people are fascinated with that world. It's a world that people haven't really seen. So it's, um, you know, it's definitely not a comedy. It's, it's, a, it's a drama. It's do, you, a, do you ride a motorcycle yourself? Well, I, I ride on the back, and I actually drive a Cadillac. I'm married to the head of the gang, so uh, club. I'm not supposed to call it a gang. It's a club. Uh, really, they told no, me not to call I'm it a gang. I'm getting mixed up between reality and real life. You know, <laughs> You, do you, dri you drive a Cadillac in the show, or you drive a Cadillac I in life? I ride a Cadillac. I drive a Cadillac in the show. Right. I also ride on the back of a bike occasionally, but I do not actually ride my own bike. No. In real life or in the in show. In real life or the or the show. You're, you should, you're correct. You should you should you uh, should get on yourself a, a big Harley there. Do you Harley's. think? Oh yeah. Do you ride one? I do. Well, you, not Harley. Oh. Well, an what Indian. do you? I mean, oh, you do. I mm. do like those. Yes. Yeah, those are nice. Oh yes. Well, you could. I was just at Harley's uh, 105th anniversary, actually, oh, down in that? Milwaukee. It was a lot of bikes. It was yes, fun. Yes, that's that's the thing about the motorcycle people. They're always bringing their motorcycles. And they're united. <laughs> yes, huh? they're so united. They, they are. all they... show loyal bunch. Well, really it's loyal. an it's very in, it's a I enjoy the the roar of the machinery and the you know the kind of feeling of the power between your legs and all do that. Do you? <laughs> You like that yourself? <laughs> I guess I've been known to like yeah, that. So yes, I, uh, on occasion. I've heard tell. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now, how have you been then? What's your summer been like? Did you I'm go good. away for the, the Labor Day? I was here, of course, working. No, I was, I, I was, well, you were not working. No, no. Was, I was working. I worked all summer, much to my children's uh, chagrin. But they did, I got away for a little bit with my your kids. Your children are French? No. <laughs> I, mean, Chagrin? I think it's French. Oh, it's yeah, French. Yeah. Well, you're so continental. <laughs> you would know. I'm American now. Now, look at those babies. That's Go right. on, I'm American. <laughs> yeah. You are American. Yeah. So I, I didn't really have much summer vacation, no, because we were working. We were shooting the show all where do you, summer. Where do you make it? Did you make it in L.A.? Uh, yes, we do, oh. in North Hollywood. And is it set in L.A.? It is set in Northern California, but oh. we made we have our little piece of Los Angeles that looks like Northern California. What piece is that? Actually, we do a lot in North Hollywood, and then we go up to Sunland. Do you know where Sunland is? I don't is? know where Sunland is. Sun Isn't that that place? <laughs> 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 Nothing. Go ahead. No, no, no. <laughs> I, I want you to tell me where Sunland is. Sunland yeah. is, um, so see, I think you're so cute. Uh, uh -huh. Sunland is uh, up north, 118 to the 210. It's up in that area. You really do like traffic. I don't do. You? Yeah. <laughs> I get lost a lot. Do so you? But you should get one of those GPS. I do. I have a GPS and I have the traffic station on my radio so I can know what's coming up. Let me ask you a question on your GPS. Lady voice or man voice? I actually have a lady voice. Really? On my, yes. I don't know how to change the voice. Oh, you can change it. I, you can I change heard. it to French if you want. I could. You can. It's called Le GPS, but it's much the similar <laughs> system as, uh, as we use. You I can see. change it to French. Oh, it goes, I gauche, I droite. Oh, I give up. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe I'll have to try that. No, it I'll really does, and you can change it. Now, I, apparently, most men with their GPSs have a man's voice because they won't listen to a woman. Oh. That's, no, no, that's, no, that's a 
survey. That's not. I'm not saying that as a joke. That's a, that, that's what they say. I'm exactly. not surprised to hear that. I'm not surprised right, to hear. Yeah. My my husband is a bit of a Walter Mitty when he gets in the car and just goes completely the different direction. Sorry, honey. He'll he might be upset, but uh, no, he won't. Sorry. Sorry. He just he he gets lost a lot. So and he doesn't really like to listen for directions. But no, and and men, of course, the old cliche: men will not ask for directions except yeah. during sex. Then they they need. <laughs> then they want to know. Yes. Then they need all the information available. <laughs> Very curious in those ways. Katie, we're completely out of time. I feel terrible. Oh, we are? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. that's all right. Yes, will you come back again? I, of course I will come when, back. When again. will you come back? Uh, whenever you would like me to come back. Well, um, soon. Soon. All right. I'll come back soon, yes. Yeah, all right then. Thank you for having me on. Oh, it's been, been a pleasure. Oh, good. Thanks for wearing that outfit. <laughs> Katie Seagal, everybody, go for right My first guest tonight is a very beautiful actress, a friend of mine. She's on the Sons of Anarchy show, Tuesdays on the FX channel, which is, uh, you know, great. <laughs> Please welcome the lovely Katie Seagal, everybody. Katie Seagal. Look at you, Katie. Oh. Good Lord. Well, look at you. Oh, my. Wow. I wore this for you. Well, yeah, that, I'm glad you wore it. There's nothing yes. that sets me off like a purple leopard. I thought you'd like it. I did. That's I actually got nice. it special just to come and talk to you. Really? Yeah, I couldn't find the right thing to wear, so I went out. Well, I think you'd be fine in anything, special. but this is just this lovely. How Thank are you? So. You well? I'm, I'm really, really well, yes. Really? I loved hearing your monologue. When... When did it be okay to say... What's that coming to go? Um, I had to say it. I just, you know, I'm on, a I'm on a series right now. I'm on a network where, you know, you can't use that word, and I've just been you wanting to say that You can't use it here, right? You know. Yeah, but you did. Yeah, I use it, but CBS, although they care, they don't really care about me. So, so I should uh, say it again. I can't say it again. I actually, I so enjoyed did, the way you said did it. Did you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because you said it in a special way. I did? Yeah. Just for you. You, you knew the way you said it, too. <laughs> it's almost as if you'd said it that way before. Maybe. My mind, yes. Yeah. Hi. Mm. Hi, baby. Hi. How are things going in the Sons of Anarchy show, then? Everyone all right? Yeah, we're shooting it up. We're banging it up. We're, we're doing... Uh, and then you're going to work. Yeah, and then yeah. I'm going, yeah. No, I do that at work. <laughs> Uh, it's, it's, is it it's season good. three? Right it's season three, and we just premiered uh, last Tuesday night. To On the FX channel. Bafo ratings, yes. Bafo? Yes, people are really... Thank you if you watch Sons of Anarchy. It's, it's, it's the motorcycle. Oh, yeah. yeah. You like it. I think yeah. you'd like it. Have you I, watched I, it? I have a motorcycle. Oh, you, you do? Yeah. Do you wear your helmet and you're safe? Do you have a Harley? <laughs> Oh, I have, I have an Indian. An Indian. Oh, I like an Indian, yeah, too. Yeah, that's, nice. that's right. That's right. Yeah. No, I have, a, nice. I have an Indian. Very nice motorcycle. But I, I, I can't ride it much in L.A. It scares oh, me riding around in L.A. in yeah. a motorcycle. I know. Yeah. My husband is now riding a motorcycle. And, really? Well, he rides the show, so he's he, he always used to ride motorcycles. Now he's done it again. And, mm. and I, I, you know, it's the one thing we disagree on. Right? You don't ride a motorcycle? I don't. Uh, well, I have three children, and I, you know, I'm really nervous about that. I don't even like to get on an airplane, so. Airplanes are, can be a little safer. A little safer. Sca safer yeah. 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 <laughs> scary for me. Really? Are you frightened to fly? I was just on a flight. I was just coming back from Hawaii, and that scary thing happened where we took off, and 10 minutes in, the guy goes, something's wrong. We're turning around. Mm -hmm. And I, am, you know, I just burst into tears, even though they all tell me it's all fine. I'm, but I'm a, I'm a scared flyer. I flyer. was a terrified flyer, and then I learned to fly. Oh, you can fly a plane? Yeah, I got a pilot's license and a motorcycle. Uh huh. You wow. Yeah. Yeah. Man. That's right. And you're married now. That's too. right. That's right. See, I am yeah, too, yeah, but yeah, I didn't yeah. wear mine. You didn't. So. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Thank by the way. you very much yeah. indeed. Yeah. yeah. So. so. Mm hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So you don't write, you're frightened to fly. Well, you were in Hawaii. I was in Hawaii, yes. No, I, took, I was having a little vacation. I had a week off, and I took my older two kids yeah. to Hawaii. We had a ball. We what had did the you best do? Time. Did you go and they eat the spam and go scuba diving? No. <laughs> we ate the pineapples and we went ATVing. Have ATVing? you ever done that? Well, no, I usually ride my motorcycle around, oh, but the ATV is so I, tough. I am a little bit tough. You See are See all tough. that kind of ooh hoo stuff <laughs> that I do? That's not really me. I'm more kind of. Uh, are you? Yeah. <laughs> 
Wow. Yeah, a little bit. A little oh, bit. I like that. You went ATVing? We did. Well, I didn't actually ride the ATV. I drove in the little uh, car behind my son and his friend. Yeah, that doesn't really count as ATV in that. <laughs> It was hardcore, I'm telling you, because it, it was up a mountain road and, and under a waterfall and under and a waterfall. Bumpy. Yes, we yes, it was beautiful. It now, was why so. would you be frightened of flying and then go ATV? And this is what was wrong with the plane, by the way, when you when you had to turn it around. It was a. Uh, this is what they told me. Right. Who knows if it's true? Right. It was a malfunctioning light, like the light just went on, and right. all of a sudden you're you're landing and there's fire trucks and. And then they, the, they, the fire trucks were Oh, out? yes. When you have to go back, they bring the thing and, you know. And yeah. then they said it was a bad light bulb. Uh -huh. so I, yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah. You know, it's sort of like the plumber. He comes to your house. He says, you need this, this, and this. I like and where you... this is going. Well. Yeah. <laughs> or the dentist. Yeah, or the pizza delivery they, no, guy. No, no, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, when they don't, you know, they tell you you need all these things and you don't really know. If you oh, the, I see. I always think the dentists are kind of like the carnies of the medical profession. You know what I mean? <laughs> They're kind of like, roll up, roll up. Oh, you need an implant oh, in your mouth. All right. that kind of thing. Did you know dentists have the highest suicide rate? Oh, I'm sorry I said that, dentist. <laughs> Which I didn't realize that. But it's really? sort of, you know, but I think it's probably because, you know, nobody really likes your dentist. Nobody likes to go. Actually, I quite like my dentist. You do? Yeah, he's a pilot. <laughs> Weird, right? Yeah, but do you like when he's digging around in your mouth? No, I don't like that. Yes, but, that's what I mean. But I don't. It's not personal. He, oh. He's not doing it because he's a bad guy. He's doing it because he has to pay for aviation fuel. That's, I see. Right. Yeah. Well, I like my dentist too, but I think that that sort of overwhelming feeling that nobody really wants to go see you. Yeah. Makes them. That's sad. what it's like to be Scottish. <laughs> <laughs> kind of. You might be Scottish dentist. Oh, like. horrible. Uh. I like the Scottish. You do? Oh yes. Yeah, have, you, have you been over there much? I have not, but we have a. Uh, That'll be a why you like them so much. Then, yeah. Well, we have one on our TV show. A, a, a man named Tommy Flanagan. Do you know Tommy? I know Tommy Flanagan. I think. Yes. There was Tommy Flanagan in Braveheart. He was in Braveheart. Yes. He's I a fantastic he's actor. He's a very good actor, Tommy Flanagan. I can Flanagan. barely understand a word he says, but yeah, me, he's fantastic. Me too. Yeah, me too. Yeah, me too. You Scottish with that accent? Well, I've apparently lost my accent completely. <laughs> Says who? It's people in Scotland, they're like, oh, listen to you, you Yankee Doodle. Really? Oh, no, I think you still sound I very think I Scottish. sound reasonably Scottish. I, I do too. Yeah. In an American sort of way. Well, I am an American. I've been here 15 years now. So are you a citizen? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I, you got, are. I got my tattoo and everything. Look you, at that. Let me say that. Yeah, what does yeah. that say? It says join or die. Oh, you are such a badass. <laughs> should come be on the Sons yeah, of Anarchy. Yeah. You're a badass. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah, no, I got I have three tattoos. Do you? Yeah. Where where? This one? Here and other places. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I too. You are so I bad. You are I'm, so bad. I'm really not that bad. Nah, come no, come on. I'm not. So where do you, have you become a bike mama now? Do they uh, invite you to all the bike rallies and I, stuff? I do. I have a whole new audience, it seems. I, I was actually a, on the cover of, uh, what was it called? It was a big biker magazine. And there Probably I was. Probably biker magazine. Something biker, yeah. yeah. And, but yes, and I do. I go to biker rallies and uh, I have Have you been to Sturgis? Base. Oh, yes. We went to Sturgis on the first I've season of our there. show. It was, it was great. Lots yeah. of Harleys and... It was wonderful. What, what do they do? They just drive up and down? Jay Leno's there and stuff? Well, I didn't see Jay there, no, but, but they do. But they all drive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's how badass yeah, Jay Leno can do it. <laughs> that's right. And there's, well, there's all different kinds of bikers. You know, you meet yeah. all different kinds just in any, any walk of life. Do you ever see any, uh, maybe seem an odd question, but you think there's such a thing as a lesbian biker? <laughs> I've met several. Yes, really, are you kidding me? Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. I, yeah, I imagine they probably are. Yeah. Yeah. Why are we... Oh, you were talking about lesbians earlier, yes. Probably. How did you get... Were there lesbians in the audience? Is that Gee, what? I wish. <laughs> no, 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 no. I, you know, I'm cool with it. I'm, you know, it's all love, baby. Oh, you're totally cool with yeah. it. You're a guy. <laughs> hey, I'm cool with guy-guy love, too. You are? Yeah, sure. Oh. Yeah. No, no. <laughs> it's not really my box of macaroni, no, but you know. Yeah, you know, it is what it is. What was that whole French fry pizza conversation? That's, I just caught the end. Were you oh. talking about skiing and. Yeah, yeah, skiing, you know, French pizza, oh, French fries. The, oh, yeah. oh, I'd never. Do you ski? I, well, I, I have skied. I'm not a very good skier. I don't, I don't like Clearly, it. you don't know pizza, French fries. That's no, the essential it was, part of skiing. I thought it was the bunny. Uh, 
Oh, I can't remember now. The bunny? The bunny slope or the bunny. Oh, that's the, the slope you go on when yeah, you're learning. Yeah, yeah, that's the name of the little. Do you like skiing? Yes. Man, you yeah. are a daredevil. Oh, man, you? I swam with sharks this year. <laughs> you did not. I sure did. Wow. Yeah. You did? Yeah. Or, what do you mean? What does that mean, you swam with sharks? I went in the water. There were and they were right sharks. next to yeah, you? They were right there, and I fed them a little bit of fish on a pole, and uh, then we, it was on Shark Week in the Discovery Channel. I'm oh, telling you, it was awesome. It was? You are, see, you're an adrenaline junkie. It's that, it's that... Well, I'm a junkie. I mean, <laughs> well, adrenaline is quite... I mean, adrenaline okay, if it's going to be adrenaline, that's then right. it'll have to be adrenaline. But that's all that's left. Yeah, you that's know, it. Adrenaline work. and hats. Uh, that's, ah. that's mm. We're done now. That's it. Are we are? Yeah. We're done? All right. Want to do an awkward pause? Oh, do you know, we should just mention one thing. Did they oh. all watch Futurama when we were on together? You know, oh, I was, yeah, remember yeah, you were yeah. Susan I played a boil Boyle? On your ass. You were the boil, yeah. right. Did you see it? Yeah, do you have the clip of that? It's so... We should show the clip. It was so, so good. <laughs> Katie Seagal, everybody. We'll be right back. Yeah, I know you. You haven't been here before. I have, have not you? been to the big no. room. Yeah, no. the fire. The fire too hot for you? No, it's, it's okay. I, I thought it was just fine. Yeah, yeah all right. You look great, oh, Katie. I well, mean, thanks. great. I mean, like, wow. You know, I mean, really. I'm hanging in there. No, I mean, it's uh, it's really. Well, what are you doing? I mean, uh, what are you doing? You know, just, do you do a lot of? Mm, mm, I do. Mm, <laughs> just like that. Do you use that? Use that machine? That, I, <sighs> I, do. <laughs> I do that one, I do this one, I do a lot of them. I yeah, do I bet this you do, one. yeah. Yeah, I do a lot of them. Is that, do you think that's true, by the way, that if you talk during sex, it's more exciting? Uh, well, uh... <laughs> Depends what you're talking about. I, 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 I like some talking during sex. Right, that's, but not things like, your mother's really annoying me. Oh, no, 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 not those kinds of things. No, no. I like a little of the, uh, the uh, you know, the nasty talk. Oh, really? Yeah. Like, uh, well, uh, well, for instance. <laughs> well, let me hear your best shot. No, uh, no, no, we shouldn't do that here. No, okay. probably no. not. No. No. I, I, no. no. Yeah. But maybe we should do it somewhere else. Maybe. All right. I, uh, I was just talking to your gorgeous wife. My wife is backstage, and child. I will get killed now for saying that. Yes, yeah. We don't want to do that. Yeah, my, uh, my littlest boy is running Oh, around he's my... so beautiful. No, he shouldn't be up this late. It's over past 12.30 in your region, but... Uh, <laughs> How many kids you got? I have three kids. Uh, they're they're oh, oh. 18, 16, and five. Whoa. I have a five-year-old also, yeah. who's just as energetic as little Liam there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was looking But five is good, because then they go to school, and you go like, ah. Well, she just started kindergarten, yes, and so far I've, I've picked her up early. <laughs> yeah. But she's, she's adjusting. She's going to be fine. You she think? will be. Yeah, yes. yeah, it should be fine. Yeah, They're all yeah. fine. This is the thing about having older kids. You realize that, with, even with the younger one, that they get through, them all, through it all. Well, yeah, I didn't fine. listen to the second one, because the first one I was kind of like, oh, is he breathing? And I'm like, yeah, he's good. He's fine. Yeah. <laughs> and this one will be way more well-adjusted than your first. Not that your first isn't well-adjusted. He's well fine. No, he's great. Oh, yeah, good. yeah, yeah. He's like, you know, he's very sensible. He's like, Dad, your jokes are not funny to me. <laughs> He said that to me. Do your kids think you're cool? You're in a very cool show. Well, you would think, th well, sometimes they think I'm cool. But, uh, and my husband is also very cool. And right. we, we just think we're, you know. You think you're cool? Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I think as far as cool. parents go. Yeah, you know. yeah. I, I think. And, uh, but no, they kind of actually don't, you know, which really surprises me. I think it's just, it's inherent in the genetic coding that you can't find your parents cool even if you're cool. This is what I'm telling myself because I think that I'm cool, but no one in my family does. No one in your family does? Yeah. Well, they did to a certain age. How old's your oldest? Uh, Eleven and a half. And he already doesn't think you're cool? He hasn't thought I was cool since he was eight. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Occasionally I'm cool. Uh, occasionally, if I do. Do you ever play the guitar? 
That's the worst I could do. Oh, really? He yeah, I'm like, that? come on, son. If I had a hammer. <laughs> no, you have to play like, you know, you, you have to play a little bit cooler than that. Well, I don't know. Can you play the guitar? I actually can't. Then they like me. See, when I play music and they come in here, my band, or they come in like they want to write music with me, then, oh, then, then we cool. get along. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they're very talented. I think of you as a singer. I didn't know you actually, uh, you know. I do. I play. I write. Yeah. I sing. I, you know, nice. I do lots of things. Yeah, I know you do. I do that during sex. Yeah. Play, you play the guitar ride. during sex? <laughs> yeah. But you have to do that. You have to do that thing by there. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. How's your summer been? What have you been up to? Anything exciting? Well, we've been you, you don't work shooting. during the summer, do you? Yeah, we, no, we do. Oh, really? We shoot from May to October. Oh. So we're, we don't Looking forward to the winter of that? Actually, yes. Yeah. Spring break is our big holiday time. Where do you go? Uh, Cancun? Uh, do some Italy. shots? And, oh, right. Italy. Took yes. my kids yeah. to Italy this year. That was really... Uh, that's very nice. I like Italy. I do, too. Every time I go to Italy, I think, why don't I live here? I'm oh, a jerk. It was fantastic. I know. It was beautiful. What is your favorite part? I like Torino. Oh, I've never been to it's Torino. It's northern Italy. It's uh, Turin. Oh. Torino. Wow. I love to I like to say it like this. Like I speak right. Italian. <laughs> the implication is I speak Italian, but I'm just not doing it right now. <laughs> Italian. Yeah, that's right. Because I don't really speak Italian, <laughs> but if I talk like this, you think, oh, maybe he speaks maybe Italian. Maybe he does. You know, a little bit, a little bit, maybe a little bit. <laughs> that was good. Yeah. Very but good. I don't speak Italian. You speak Italian? No. Oh, God, no. No, I don't speak any language. I wish I did. I wish well, I where are the Seagals cool. from originally? Russian. Russian's a great language. Do you think? I've yeah. never been. I would love to. Yes. Russia? Have you never been to Russia? I've never been to oh, Russia. Oh, it's an amazing place you should go. Yeah, I would yeah. really, really like to But where have though. you been to in Europe? Well, I've been to England. Oh, that. I've been to France. I see. Times. I see where this is going. I've been to. It, where's it going? The, the uh, ladies' underpants. <laughs> <laughs> I've been to England. I've been to France. No. I've seen a ladies' underpants. No, that's where you went. I always where's go the to the ladies. Where's the electric guy? There, this guy makes the this electric guy. Electric guy. <laughs> The electric guy. Yeah, that's you, buddy. Yeah, that's Where have thing. you been? Oh, well, I'm right here, baby. <laughs> <laughs> this guy really is something else. Yeah, yeah, he is, yeah. Where'd you dig him up? Uh, well, uh, we actually did dig yeah, him up. Did. Uh, and, uh, <laughs> and reanimated him. I don't know. It, came, it was something to do with Ghost Rider. And, uh, you know, did you see that movie, Ghost Rider? I, I didn't see the Ghost Rider movie. Well, no. It's the Nick Cage. He, he's a skeleton oh. goes on fire, rides oh. a motorcycle. Oh, no, I didn't. I ah, it's that. a beautiful movie. Oh, he should come on our show. We ride motorcycles. You do? You ride we motorcycles ride around? We ride motorcycles on our Ooh, show. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Do you ride a motorcycle? I, well. I don't. Sometimes I'm on the back. But I, I used to do that in my youth. <laughs> Oh, come on, man. I mean, if it's just... At least I didn't do anything. I just went... Yeah. No, I don't actually ride them. No, they're, they're fun. They, do you I, ride them? I, well, I had an accident a few years ago. And oh, I you did? Went, uh, it's not the same after your accident. Were you riding in Los Angeles? No, I was riding a Harley Davidson V-Rod. It's a giant bike. Yes, I know. But I was riding it around country lanes in England. It's not built for that. Oh, and so... And so I tried to go around a corner, and the bike's like, no way, I'm an uh, American. Uh, <laughs> Ow, did you hurt yourself? Yeah, broken collarbone and three ribs. See, it's dangerous. Yeah. I tell my husband, my husband likes to ride the motorcycles too. Yeah, but you kind of like it a little bit. Well, you know, I actually, uh, I, have, I have resigned myself to it. There's not much I can do about it. Yeah, no, not really. No. But you, could, you could forbid him. I could, but yeah. I tried it. I did try to do that. And yeah. then, and it really doesn't work. He's, he's you know, strong-willed. I like that. I do too. Plus, you know, he makes his living off writing about motorcycle shows. So what am I going to say? Don't ride one? I can't say that. No, you can't say that. No. We're out of time. We are already? We're done? <laughs> Didn't you want to ask me about Futurama? Oh, yeah. Uh, who's Futurama Futurama's doing? great. Casey yeah. <laughs> Gallo, everybody. Move around. Katie, really lovely. Thank I you. love that dress. Thank yeah. you. 
Thank you, Craig. Hey, now listen, when I was introducing you after that great clip, by the way. Yeah, that was pretty awesome. Yeah, right? I was a little bit like, I wouldn't oh. wouldn't mess with her, yeah. Well, I, I kind of, I, I'm kind of, I like that. I like forceful, strong personalities <laughs> like that. Well, I'm kind of, I'm used to it. I, I grew up around tough people. Really? Yeah, didn't you? Sort of slammed around a little. Yeah, tough. Uh, silently tough. Silently tough. Quiet. Tough. Passive aggressive. Yeah, a little bit. Mm, yeah. Just the stink eye. You know yeah, I mean? a little bit. Kind of. Oh, if that's what you like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, a little yeah, bit. Yeah. Uh, oh, and then it got loud too, though. No, it was, it was kind of across the board. Where did you grow up? Here. In California. I was born in Hollywood. Oh my yeah. goodness. I know. I'm here. Still. I think of you as being sort of a real person. Do you? Yeah. <laughs> Well, you know, if you grow up in Hollywood and yeah. you're around it, yeah, you, you are of... a real person within it. Yeah, I guess. My kids were born here. They seem reasonable. I think, well, yeah. <laughs> it's only the people that come here and think that this is the... You they know, have to behave in a certain that's way. That's right. You mean like people from other countries? Is people that what you're saying? other countries, yeah. <laughs> But look, look how you've survived. Yes, I have, you sort have. of. Well, not really survived. Uh, well, yeah, survived. I think survived. I would say thrived. Thrived. No, I think survived is better. Yeah, like, <laughs> like, like a cockroach after a nuclear explosion. <laughs> True story. Is Sons of Anarchy winding up then? Is it the end of the... No, no, we have... Well, we just finished season six. And but the, we'll the next go... one is going to be the last one? Yes, we'll probably go seven. That'll be... And then that'll end. be it? Yes, I think so. Then you're going to have empty nest syndrome. Doesn't your husband I write might, it? I know, and my older kids will be in college. Everything will be just... Oh, then you have to go on tour. That's the I idea. Might. Yeah, yes. go on tour with the band. There you go. Maybe yeah. I will. Yeah, you'll That's have to. That's what I did for many, many years. I know, didn't you? Well, you worked with uh, Ben Midler for years, Midler right? Midler. You were a harlot. Etta James, Bob Dylan. I was a background yeah, yeah, you're That's the real thing. I, oh, I know. Yeah. I know. I did, did my research. You did? <laughs> I don't did know research. Did you Google me? No. Do you Google people? Only myself sometimes. <laughs> Do you learn new things? Nah, I never learned anything about myself that I liked on the Google, oh, I have really? to say. No. On I, Wikipedia? No, I learned that I'm a jerk, uh, I'm not funny, oh. but I can play the harp. Oh, can you? No, I you not at all. Drums. Aren't you a drummer? I was a drummer, yeah. I was yeah. married at one time to a drummer. How'd that go? Well. I'm not anymore. Yeah. When I was a drummer, I was married to someone else. Were you? That's yeah. right. Let's see. I don't know what that means, but... Well, I don't think it was the drumming that really did it. I think it was happening when I wasn't drumming. That was oh, the problem. that was the problem, yeah. Yeah, the, the 23 hours a day I wasn't drumming. <laughs> that was the problem. That was the problem, yeah. <laughs> No, actually, my husband now is a writer. My husbands uh, before have all been musicians. Yeah, best it's go with a writer, though. yeah. Much better. Easier to bully, I've it's noticed. Definitely. Well, yeah. he's home a lot more. No, he's just home a lot more. I know yeah, where he yeah. is. Yeah, you know where he is, yeah. yeah. And he's thinking about things. He is. Yeah. He's thinking a lot. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe if I write that down, we could make a little bit of money. <laughs> write it down, then. Oh. That would be nice. And, like, is he quiet and friendly and smoke a pipe? Does he smoke a pipe? No. My husband does not smoke a pipe. He's mm. friendly, unless he doesn't really like you. But he's, uh, he's somewhat quiet, I would say. He sounds quite intimidating. Oh, he's awesome. Really? He's really, really Well, that's good. It's, it's good that you like him. I given, do. Yeah, that's, that's important. I know. How, how <coughs> now, I, tell me about this yes. album, Covered. Is it covers of uh, songs? It is. You know, I was, uh, I've had a couple of records out before, and I usually write everything. And then this one, I just kept writing songs I didn't like. So I thought, you know... <laughs> I'm just going to record some other people's so fantastic songs. Free Fallen, is that the Tom Petty song? Uh -huh, I, oh, I love that. Tom Petty. We have a picture of Tom Petty somewhere, you do? don't we? I, I'm very fond of it. I Pull love it up, Tom that Petty. picture of Tom Petty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I know it's stupid. I know it's, it's stupid. It's not stupid. It's but great. It's just At least kind you of... didn't put the blonde wig on the horse. No. That would have been another way to go. <laughs> Can you, a good way to go. Yeah, you should come and work on this show. Maybe you I you'd fit right in. <laughs> so, are you, yeah, you're going, you should go out and tour with the album. I, I out, have I you might, done any yes. gigs with this stuff yet? We have. We just played at the El Rey here in California. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's and, kind of uh, groovy, yeah, isn't it? Was really, yeah, it was so groovy. You have a lot of people smoking and wearing black leather and they stuff. They were, yeah. yeah no, we I had a good crowd. I can't do that anymore. You can't? Don't you go on the road anymore? I do go on the road, but I go with my friends and we, you know, we go for snacks and then everyone's in bed by 10 o'clock. Yeah, well, I know. <laughs> I do like very different. Too. It was an early show. I don't yeah. want to play late. And no, I don't want to like... play like three sets a night.
it. I'm like, oh. people will say to me, hey, do you want to come and see my band? I'm like, bands that are on the show? And I'm like, yeah. And then they say, we start at 10.30. I'm like, oh, no. No, I'm not going. <laughs> yeah, I know. We have to take a break. Okay. I don't really want to, but it's some rule they have about commercials. Uh, like, <laughs> the whole, because we're still on CBS, apparently. Uh, <laughs> for now. Where else would you be? Oh, I don't know. Rumors, you know. Really, there are? Yeah, I'm starting some. Yeah, oh, why not? Oh, there you go. We'll be right back with Katie Seagal. Hey. I, I, welcome back. Uh, you, you, that's nice shoes. You just put nice. the leg up there. They, is that the La Boutons? They are the Yeah, Boutons. yeah, yeah. I, I because of the red sole. Yeah. See, I like with my... I heard you have tattoos. Too. I do. I've got a bunch of them. You only, uh, that's a nice tattoo. That's a good one, right? Yeah. Yes. It's... It's actually... It's a, it's a reptile because they shed skin. Do you, do you have something. a shedding skin? Well, you know, I, I actually got it when I turned 50. I don't mind talking about my age, you sort of. Uh, when I turned 50, I got that tattoo because, you know, it's about rebirth and restarting. Oh, I got a colonoscopy. Did you? Oh, I got that too. Yeah. yeah. That was fun, wasn't it? You know, I have to say, I didn't care for the procedure much, but the drugs, holy crap. I know, man, right? Whoa. Did you count back? Oh, like they say, count back from 10, I was like 10. <laughs> and then I woke up and I said yeah. to Megan, my wife, I was like, hey, baby. <laughs> I it remember. felt so good. It yeah. felt so good. I know. Oh, Because, you know, I don't, and I was like, hmm. I thought, how can I erase, because the, the, the doctor said, hey, uh, you come back in five years, it looks fine. I said, I can come back next week. <laughs> like, let's just make it, you can't be too careful, doctor. Let's, let's just, let's just make again. it a regular thing. Come over to my house. <laughs> well, you know, at that age, there's other body parts they could check. I mean, you could actually probably go through everything and get a little buzz as they check everything. I'm into it then. That's what I'm going to do, yeah. <laughs> but we, we're done. Out. We're out of time. Actually. Oh, we are? Okay, mm. fine. It so, was really lovely to come. Uh, it's lovely to see Thank you. Thank you for having me on. And this comes out November 11th. Oh, that, is that? Oh, so that's the reason you're here. <laughs> No, Katie Seagal covered on November 11th. <laughs> November 11th it comes out. Covered. Thanks, Greg. Katie Seagal, everybody. It's one of the funniest shows on TV. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Katie Seagal, everybody, Katie Seagal. You look great, girl. Oh, well, thank you. You do. I'm giving you the whole finger wave. Oh, so do you. I liked your dance moves. Thanks there. very Thanks much indeed. Very well, you like to do something a bit special on Celebrity Ring and Oh, act. is that what it is? It, apparently, yeah. It turned out that way. <laughs> <coughs> hey, I heard your, um, you get the Hollywood uh, Walk of Fame the star, star thing? yes. Is yes. that true? Tomorrow, I do. Yes, Shut I do. Shut the front door. Oh, I know. That, congratulations. Thank you. That's a big deal. That's a big deal. Drunks will throw up on you I in perpetuity know. now. Absolutely, I know. I know. Since I was a little kid, you know, I was born in Hollywood, so wow. I've been on that boulevard for many, many years. Oh, I heard stories. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm really on the boulevard. Well, I think it's fantastic. It's a yeah. real thing. Yeah, it's pretty well, exciting. Good for you. Isn't that lovely? And the Sons of Anarchy, it's last season though, wasn't it? Last season. All right, yes. yeah. Everybody goes nuts, kills each other. Well, it's pretty dark. It's pretty bloody. It's got to be. How else could it be? Well, it, given by the five seasons before it? Six. Six seasons before yes. it? Yes. Five been of them watching. were. He's really been I never miss it. <laughs> it's like Game of Thrones on yeah. bikes. I'm all over it. <laughs> it's fantastic. What do you watch on the TV when you're not watching? Uh, your, do you watch yourself? Do I watch myself? Yeah. No, no, no. No, God. I hate, it's very difficult to watch myself. Yeah, I don't like to no, watch you don't me. Watch I watch you. Do you? Well, yeah, through, through your curtains. <laughs> 
don't watch. What do I watch? Well, I've been watching The Leftovers. I love that show. Have you watched that show? Not yet. No, I'm saving That's them up. That's a good one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> My favorite. The Leftovers. Though, See, because The Leftovers. Uh, and I heard you like this show too. What's that? The Home House Hunters International. Oh man, I'm crazy for House That's Hunters. That's our favorite I, show. I love that yes, show. Yes, we do too. Kurt Who's and I we? Watch. You, My you and Kurt. You, and, yes. you watch that? We watch it. We weigh in. We yell and scream at people. But it, it always seems to me like it's ill-advised. So you know, completely. It's like John and Stacy are are uh, tired of their humdrum life in Toronto, and they want to move to busy, war-torn Kosovo <laughs> or something like that. Right. Because like, got a Toronto's job. lovely. Stay there. Right. No, I agree. Or they'll buy like you know the I know money's an issue, but they'll buy the one that's like no, just spend the extra couple thousand. I know a and year. It's it's like oh it's it's bad, and they always really some terrible places that terrible. they go to. I know. It's Do you fun, have a though. what? It's fun to watch. It's fun to judge other people. I fun. find <laughs> I. I find really? especially the choices that they make. I if agree. you watch them on TV and you go, ah, it's kind of, it's a little more sophisticated than hating on people who are auditioning for American Idol. <laughs> Yes. See what I mean? Like, you know, when you watch people which was auditioning... mean. That was mean. That's mean. I don't want to do that. But actual people who are making decisions which they don't have to make, you go, you're an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> and then I feel good about myself. Good. Yeah. Have, would you ever live in another country, like a dangerous place? A dangerous place? Yeah, like, well, I don't know it's if Kosovo dangerous. is dangerous now, I but it used to be. Everywhere's dangerous. I, yeah, I you know, you're it's right. It's pretty hard to live anywhere right now. Uh, no, I'm actually, I actually love where I live. I oh, you're, you're from Los we're Angeles, so which is here. so yes, rare. It is rare. To and be... every time I come back, I'm glad I'm here. Well, where, where did you go? Well, I go lots of places. I'm an actor. We go lots of places. <laughs> Well, well, really? Don't you, don't you go play? You are so international. I, I, well, I go to the valley sometimes. Yeah. That's about it. But don't you go? Don't you go traveling around? Aren't you that guy? But I, I have to be here every whiskey that's night. True. Yeah. That's true. That's true. Yeah. 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 But uh, but I'm finishing in December. It's the uh, after. How do you the, feel about that? I'm actually very excited about that's it. Good. I you know it's time. It's good to move oh, on. It was time a couple of years ago, but it's time now. <laughs> Change is good. I think so. I a think so. What nervous. are you going to do once your, your show finishes? Well, Do another I'm, one? No. Well, I would like to do another one in the cable world. I really enjoy that because I like the schedule. I like the quality. Yeah. That's all good. So I'm it's not going to be Peg Bundy, a one-woman show or anything I don't think like so, that? No. I I'm very glad to hear no, that, no, no, by no, the no, way. No. Yeah. The wig is somewhere else. Right. Um, <laughs> I'm doing a movie in November, and I just did another movie called Pitch Perfect. I'm in Pitch Perfect 2, so I'm just... Pitch Perfect 2? Yeah. Yeah. Or Pitch Perfect? Pitch Perfect 2. I'm in the sequel. I didn't see the first one. Ah. <laughs> what happens in the first one? Oh, it's so awesome. It's about a cappella choirs in colleges. I, I can't believe I didn't see this. Oh, it's so... <laughs> it was a huge hit. Didn't you guys watch it? Yeah, no, I... I, I, I yeah, no. See? I... See, you're going to have time now. Oh, see, yeah, I'm going to be sitting. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Pitch Perfect 2. And what I'll do, because I'm crazy, <laughs> is I'll watch per Pitch Perfect 2. Then I'll watch ah, Pitch Perfect. It's much more exciting like, that way. Deconstructing the genre, baby. <laughs> no, it's fine. I'm sorry for putting my feet up That's there. That's all right. So I didn't, didn't mean to. It's your house. You can do that. Can I? Yes. I guess. Do you put your feet up in the furniture? At home? You know what I'm talking yes, about. Yes, I do, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I do. Yeah, I bet you do. <laughs> <laughs> so you having a party tomorrow then for your big uh, Hollywood thing? Well, they do. They, well, they're throwing a party for me. You kind of go to Hollywood Boulevard and they have a, a bunch of, you know, a celebration. And then right. we have a party across the street from where... I'm, I'm not sure where the star is yet, so... Because well, oh, it's a long street. You it is. Get, you I could get a be good... east of Vine. No. Right? I don't know. You're, that's the <laughs> loser part of the street to be on. Well, I've got my star on Hollywood Boulevard, uh, near but the Pantages. it's in Silver Lake, so... <laughs> I'm not sure exactly, but it, the party is somewhere near there. Yes, they have a well, celebration. That'd be nice. Really nice. Yes. Very sweet. Yeah, I'm really pleased for yes. you. Take the kids. I'm not going to be too self-deprecating. That's what I've decided. Right, I decided okay. to embrace it and accept it and be happy. That's very evolved. It is, don't uh, you It think? is. I think you're clearly you're uh, getting a ton of therapy and it's working. It's working <laughs> well. Yeah. Well, you know, you live a certain amount of years, you have to ask a lot of questions. You, you, I mean, I, I hate to be rude, but you must be creeping up in 35 by now, <laughs> girl. Ah, that's right, right. So 
So what should we talk about now? Well, we, actually, we actually have to take a commercial break. Oh. I just hate giving them the satisfaction. Can I just ask you a question? Sure, why not? How old are your children now? Um, well, uh, one is 13. Oh. And the other one is three. Oh. So what we do is uh, Scottish people ejaculate once every 10 years. <laughs> they, it's like, you see the, uh, you know these uh, big, the big orchids in the jungle? That just go, uh, that's like, that's like Scottish people and whoever's around gets pregnant. Ah, and that's there it. you go. And you only have two children? Well, you know, I, luckily I was in a secluded area. I see. Uh, we have to take a break. We'll be right back with Kitty Cigar. <laughs> It's nuts. We're back on. Oh, we are? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that was a quick commercial break. It was, no, it was actually regular length. It was regular. <laughs> oh, the magic of TV. Yeah, no, it was good. Did you ever buy something from a commercial? Like, did you ever watch an, uh, an infomercial and go, I need that click point go? Oh, yeah. Really? <laughs> really? <laughs> what, is that a clue? You smelled your fingers no, there? No, no, no. You went like that, and then you went... Like, what, what did no, you buy? No, no, no. no, I have bought a few embarrassing things. I bought a Snuggie. That's not embarrassing. That's not, I, I refuse to, that's a fine American item. You did sit you like down, a Snuggie? You sit down when you're Snuggie, it's a, like a, like a straight jacket, but comfortable, and you watch TV. Right. That's beautiful. I bought some cooking utensils, you know, the, the magic bullet and all those. <laughs> oh my God. I, I don't guess, think that's for I cooking. Guess. Cooking. All right. <laughs> that must be a different Bright magic red. bullet than that. No, no, Stop no, no, smelling no, no, no. your fingers. I got a magic time. bullet. No, oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for heaven's sake. Oh, wow. This really is the end of the run, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. <laughs> this, this is a man with nothing left to lose. <laughs> Hey, we're out of time anyway. Oh, we are? Okay. Yeah, yeah, no, you're good. Uh, so uh, you'll be able to go up to Hollywood and uh, get your star That's and then right. go and enjoy your magic bullet. You and <laughs> I knew, I should, oh, never mind. I'm so embarrassed. Why? I don't know, why not? Yeah, it's all right. You don't need to be embarrassed. You're amongst friends. America yeah, loves you. And I have a star, so. Yeah. <laughs> Up. So, uh, look, I'll, I gotta be honest with you, I'm a little bit angry. I know you're like, how can we tell? And I'm like, watch this. Oh, 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 I am so angry because someone has disgraced the South. And you know, don't you boo. <laughs> you know who I'm talking about. <laughs> Joe Wilson. <laughs> he from South Carolina, he yelled at the president during the thing. And I'm like, hey, come on, baby, don't do that. <laughs> now, I'm from Louisiana, which is not, you know, anywhere near here. But... <laughs> Man, it's a long way to walk when you're a little crocodile, I tell you. <laughs> but don't worry, don't worry, because you know, I know how I got here, hitchhiking. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I know what you're thinking, people are like, uh, you, uh, hey, how do you manage to get a ride? You're a fearsome predator. <laughs> and I'm like, yeah, but I'm charming. Ladies put aside their natural prejudice when they hear my dulcet tones. 
And I wave to them, hi, girls, I say. And they're like, ooh, baby, you're the man. And I'm like, no, baby, I ain't the man. I'm the fearsome predator of love. <laughs> hey, anyway, you know, I'm a little angry at Joe Wilson because he shouted at the president and made us all look kind of, you know, rude. And we ain't rude in the South. We are, we are polite. And um, punctual. And uh, forgiving. And we smell a little bit like vanilla. So, uh, what to do, everybody? What to do? All right, all right.